The Director of Public Prosecutions has once again dropped corruption charges against a high-profile personality. This time around, the DPP withdrew charges against Edith Kimani, the daughter of politician and current Lance CAS Kimani Gonjiri. Edith Kimani, who is also a former Nakuru County Chief Officer for the Department of Trade, Tourism, Industries and Investment, was charged alongside seven others with embezzlement of public funds in the construction of market sheds at the Kiratina Market in the Menangai Ward of Nakuru County. Edith Kimani and six other suspects, including officers of the Nakuru County government and the directors of levy contractors, the company contracted to construct the Kiratina market sheds, were arrested and charged in court on the 31st of January 2023. This after the Ethics and Anti-Corruption Commission received allegations that the county government of Nakuru had paid around 10 million Kenya shillings for the construction of Kiratina market. It was alleged that levy contractors limited after winning the tender to construct two market sheds only put up one. Investigations found that an incompetent contractor was engaged, which led to the collapse of the structure before it was handed over to the county. To date, it has not been completed. Further investigations revealed that levy contractors was paid 3.9 million Kenya shillings but did not construct two sheds. The procurement was marred by irregularities. The tenders were opened on the 26th of February 2017, which was a Sunday. Yet government offices do not operate on weekends. The alleged members of the tender opening committee did not take part in the tender opening exercise. No tender opening register was ever opened. Levy contractors did not submit a valid tax compliance certificate. Its tax compliance certificate expired on the 27th of January 2017 before the tendering process commenced. The contractor was not registered with the National Construction Authority, yet the tender committee recommended it for the award, eventually awarded the contract at 7.9 million Kenya shillings. The former chief officer in the Department of Trade, Edith Wanjiro Kimani, stated that she reviewed the procurement process and awarded the tender after being satisfied that the procurement procedures were adhered to. The former chief officer in the Department of Trade, Edith Wanjiro Kimani, did not involve technical staff from the Department of Public Works in the evaluation of tenders. But in a new development, the DPP withdrew the charges against the first accused, Edith Wanjiro Kimani, informing the court that the evidence against Kimani was not sufficient to sustain charges against her. The other co-accused persons were charged afresh on Tuesday, 28th, March 2023, based on an amended charge sheet. The case will be mentioned on the 11th of April 2023, ahead of a hearing on the 16th and 17th of October 2023. This is one among many high-profile persons whose corruption cases have been dropped by the DPP in the recent past, including Deputy President Rigathe Gashagwa, former Kenya Power Managing Director Ben Chumo, Kenya Pipeline MD Joe Sang, and former Nairobi Governor Mike Sonko. Lillian Muli, Citizen TV.